to this posture once again but this time we're not going to be using the hands as a grabbing technique before in all the different tegumis we were talking about um, doing uh, multiple movements on the hand whether you make a fist to hit with or whether you make a fist to grab with you always have to think of the yin and the yang if my hand is up in this position I'm not just blocking I might be holding something as you saw earlier in the film or what about the elbow attacking let me show you what I mean. Okay, we're in here, I moved into it, I came up on it, I dropped down on it, he went for the waist tackle, put him into this position, I tried the Hawaiian triangle, he slipped out, he came right around with this, and now I just kick my elbow right down in the nerves of the trapeze. <laughs> Is he okay? Yeah. Pass yeah, right down, down, huh? Takes your legs right out. And I came down on the trapezius. You've seen this in other films, you saw this in um, the Wing Chun Tegumi, you also saw this in uh, the Seuchin filming. Different targets on both of them, but the same kind of result. Person is on the floor. It's a good day. And all I did is right out of this Hawaiian triangle, okay, as he w went for the rotation or the escape, I caught him in here, I slid off him, and then I just dropped this right on the trapezius muscle. Or from this side, I just dropped it, oh. okay? Using that elbow, you can go in between the clavicle and the, the trapezius muscle where you have the brachial plexus in here. You can hit right on top of the shoulder muscle where you have another nerve under there as well. Doesn't matter, okay? As long as you make sure that you're not hitting with the back of your arm, which is padded, you have to make sure that your arm maintains the sanchin integrity, 45 degree angle, and you can see the result of the point of the elbow, not the back of the elbow, not the front of the elbow. So a little bit of sanchin. 